Okay, hello, hi, this is Ryan Ahmed with you, and in this video, I'm going to explain to you how to use uh, this piece, this black bo uh, big black block. Okay, uh, it's, an eye, uh, it's a web camera, uh, Ostak web camera, 5 uh, megapixel. It's dedicated for, uh, you can use it as a normal PC web camera, of course, but it is dedicated mainly for. Uh, uh, for viewing what's uh, on the eyepiece, this is the eyepiece, this piece here, until the screw, okay, here you can see the screw a little bit, okay, so, um, uh, from uh, this screw till here, okay, this is the eyepiece of, of the telescope, it's a zoom eyepiece, and here I have uh, a screw, okay, which I screw to fasten the eyepiece and the uh, camera together, to attach, to attach, to attach them to, uh, together, okay, so, um, <coughs> so uh, currently the camera is off okay now what we are going to uh, view uh, is this scene here the I the C okay at, at far okay so this is the C you see the blue line here at the end after the door at the uh, uh, windows okay so this place here let me zoom in a little bit with my camera Okay, so we, we're talking about this here, okay? The C. Okay, now I'm going to zoom out now just because I want to uh, view myself, okay? And uh, this is a Wi-Fi camera and a USB camera at the same time. So now I'm going to uh, show you how it will work, okay? Uh, now uh, we have here... Uh, an old iDrone, uh, Samsung phone, Android phone, and I have also uh, an iPad, okay, which will also uh, have a copy of the software that you can run to see the contents of uh, the uh, camera. See, this is the telescope, see, and the reflection of the iPad. So, uh, this is the uh, telescope, okay. So, <coughs> uh, so now I'm going to uh, remove it, okay, just to show you how it uh, it's attached. So uh, I'm removing the eyepiece now, okay, here. And if you see here with me, okay, see how uh, I can hold it like this. How? Because this is uh, this is like a, a drill, you know, the drill which you puncture the whole wall with, okay. And here I have this little. Uh, you know, a cup of a pipe, okay, uh, plastic pipe. Uh, it, it, we uh, the uh, camera comes with the, a number of those uh, slices, okay, uh, with different sizes uh, for different eyepieces. Because maybe you have an eyepiece not this size, for example, you have an eyepiece as small as this size, okay. Uh, maybe and it works also with uh, microscopes. So uh, when I put the uh, ring here, okay, and this and fasten it, okay, and uh, please because the the uh, eyepiece always inverts the uh, image. So if you have it something like this, okay, on the eyepiece, uh, uh, it will the eyepiece will invert it. So you must rotate the camera something like this with a little bit of an angle you will you will notice that when you use the uh, camera okay and uh, pass it always remember that uh, rotation angle for uh, the uh, uh, for the view so to, if you wanna uh, like uh, take v videos of something ter uh, terrestrial so uh, the eyepiece will give you it like this so uh, the uh, angle that's given by the camera like this will make it uh, correctly horizontal okay so I'm gonna uh, put it again here and fasten it uh, okay there's something I forgot to tell you about before I put it there's this knob here okay this is just to uh, make the field of view correct okay you just uh, like um, fix it okay yourself uh, and you'll understand that when you see the the view, okay, you see black, uh, 
black shades inside the uh, applications of the telephone, okay, uh, on, the, on the camera applications. So you see uh, black shades, so you have to get rid of them by rotating this uh, knob, okay. Now, uh, because I've uh, messed with the knob now, uh, you will see those shades, okay, the black shades. Okay, and of course I messed with the uh, resolution. Oh, okay, sorry, there's something else. I forgot. Okay, I know I'm forgetting so many things. So uh, here I have a, you can a, you can uh, uh, like uh, charge it with a uh, USB uh, like this one USB charger. Okay, the same one that comes with the USB charger. It comes also with with its packaging. Uh, USB charger, okay? I don't have the packaging right now with me, okay? Because I'm at uh, work and I'm just putting the telescope just for fun, okay? Just to pass my time. So, uh, this is the uh, charger. You can just simply, okay, uh, put it like here, okay? And just plug it into the wall, of course, and it's just to get a charging. The other side of the, uh, is a USB 2, but you can use it with your PC, so you can directly read what's uh, the contents of the camera and what the camera is seeing on, on the uh, uh, computer using a Windows app, and you can also use the VLC uh, media player uh, to uh, watch uh, the contents of the camera, okay? Or the, uh, what the camera is seeing. I don't know what's, <laughs> which is the correct English, I know what it's saying. Okay. And also, there's here, you see there's a little hole, this is to reset the Wi-Fi, okay? Uh, and you can also make the uh, Wi-Fi uh, connect to an uh, access point, okay? Let's see, get you an example of an access point. So, you can get, for example, this access point, for example, this is an access point, and this is a Wi-Fi camera. Now this one, uh, can, this camera, I mean, can work like an access point and then you can get your uh, phones connecting uh, to it, okay? Or you can connect this uh, camera to the uh, access point and then the other uh, telephones can connect to the, uh, and of course your uh, mobile phone, uh, your laptop, of course, I mean, you can connect to uh, this. And then uh, this way, this will be the means between uh, the, uh, the viewing devices and the camera, okay? For mobile uh, laptop, you know? So, now, in my office, there are, uh, there are access points, okay? And we're going to use them, okay? Inshallah, if I have the uh, space in my phone, okay? Now, yeah, and there is here also the uh, knob. So when I first I put it to the uh, last, this red means that the, car, the, the, the battery is almost uh, like uh, empty. Okay, now you see the, uh, uh, this blue uh, blinking, this means the Wi-Fi is, turned on, is turning on. Now if I put it in the middle, in the middle, sorry, Okay, and if I put it in the middle here, like the, I mean the knob, power knob, it means that I want to use it as a USB camera, okay? Uh, it doesn't need any power, just it will run from the uh, laptop's uh, power, okay? Now, I have made videos how to stream it out online, okay? So, please look at uh, how to broadcast the uh, camera online, okay? So, please look them up in my channel, okay? Now, I'll show you both the iPad and the iPhone and the uh, Android. Now, the iPad is the same with the iPhone, same thing, you just install that app. So, the app is called UC, uh, UCAM Plus, okay? This one. Okay, you got here something UCAM Plus. Okay. Cool. Now, I'm going to turn it on, okay, but before that, of course, you have to connect to the camera. So, we go to my settings, okay, to the telephone settings, okay, and of course, go to the Wi-Fi section, okay, and see, you will see here a Wi-Fi camera, okay.
Okay. So the camera's uh, camera now is acting like the access point. Okay. Now this way uh, your iPad will not be connected to the internet by default because this means uh, the, this camera here uh, is not a gateway to the internet. Okay, it's not your door to the internet. It, it won't work like that. Okay, you will have to turn it uh, as a, a device similar to a, a mobile phone to connect to an access point. Then you can uh, get it online. Okay. So as you said, and the password for this Wi-Fi is from uh, 1 to 8, okay? Just type the numbers from 1 to 8, okay? Now, I go to Ucount Plus. First of all, it's, it's now connected, but how do I connect? I go back here first of all, and then go to the I here, okay? And here you'll find the things that are saved. Look, the same interface is found on the uh, Android, okay? But the difference is that it's easier to access your files on uh, your Android device. Okay, and uh, please get a faster Android device because all the devices will um, be slower to, you know, you to get things uh, done. Okay, yeah. so I go back here and you'll see the uh, things that I'm trying to uh, shoot. Okay, so here I'm moving the telescope. Okay, and uh, you see some shades here. See, there's a black shade here. So because the, I'm, uh, I rotated the knob, the knob okay. So see when I change the knob, okay, in the back, so you get black shades. So that's why you have to fix this, okay? And you can see here other, uh, config uh, other configurations, okay, or other uh, settings, okay, for the resolution. Please don't use higher, very high resolutions, it will be very slow, okay? Uh, and you can also make this like, go like this and this, okay? If you made it like this, it will, you can just move it. Okay, and also there are other settings like here. Okay, I'll show you. Good. Anyway, there are other settings here, like for example the brightness contrast focus. You can see them on the app later. Okay. And also you can uh, do some kind of rotation, 180 rotation like this. Okay, and like this. Okay, flip over and those two. Okay, and if you want to save you uh, or start recording, this is this button is for the uh, pictures, and this is for videos. Okay, so you take a single picture here and take a complete video like here. But you have to understand that it takes a lot of space. Okay, so it will suck all your space quickly. Okay, so be uh, careful when you uh, put your uh, or use uh, uh, one of those resolutions. Okay. Now, um, same here, the Android. So on the Android, there's a same app with a different name, okay? And the same app is or the UCAM Plus is already there, but I advise you to use the same app with a different name, okay? There's a one called Copa. See here, there's a Copa, okay? I'm trying to focus it, but it's not. Anyway, so um, this Copa, uh, Copa Vision Pro, okay, find it. It's, uh, it's available on Play Store. It's just open, same, same interface, let's so just open it like this, okay? And you see the same interface, very, very same interface. There's no difference, okay? But the good thing is with the file management. So you can easily uh, put your uh, files somewhere else if there's no space, okay? You can just move to the SD card quickly, okay? So um, so now it's not connected, so I have to connect it, okay? This is an old uh, Android 4 uh, system, okay? This one. So I see here there's the camera, okay? Okay, uh, I can go back to uh, the uh, application, the Copa, okay.
Ja, hier, like I show you, like, see, I'm, I'm moving now the camera, the telescope, okay? So it's the same, 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 same app, okay? Same interface. See? Yeah, I can get the, the, the resolutions, okay? You can see here, the brightness on the other, other, okay? And, um, yes, and there's also here something for the exposure of the light. Okay, I've been showing you, and you can zoom in, zoom out by pinching. Okay, so uh, this is the uh, camera, and I hope that uh, you enjoyed it. Um, and uh, there's also in the settings, okay, here, uh, you go to the settings through this uh, gear wheel, okay, and then go to here, first one. And then if I want to make it uh, connect to the other uh, access point, okay, I have an access point up there. Uh, I'm serious, okay? So uh, I can just go to AP client mode and I also select the one of the access points that are there and then just type its password, okay? So I'm going to use this one that's, that's now here, the showroom, okay? I'm going to put its password. Now, if you do this, so it means that all your friends can see uh, what's, on, what's on the camera in, in the office, okay? So, <laughs> you know, uh, so, and they, don't, they won't be disconnected from the internet at the same time. So they can do whatever they like and you can, have in a way that you just uh, host them uh, politely, you know? Then I type the confirm button, okay? Then it's switching to the AP mode, okay? Then I'm, uh, then what I do is AP client mode now, okay? Now I search and connect, okay? You ha don't uh, get out yet, okay? You have to search and connect number of times until you find an IP here. Okay, you find the number here. Okay, that number you should select. Okay, so you found, it found the number. So this is the number of the uh, camera on the uh, network, on the local network, okay? So I just select that, and I go back, and then uh, I have uh, to Uh, go to the settings and make sure, and it will tell you also, now it's connected to uh, the phone, it's connected to the uh, showroom, okay? So I go back to the app, and I, I select this, the, uh, the eye, okay? You can see the camera is changing, okay, it should be changing, yeah, it changed, see it changed. Okay, so this you can see the change in the C. Okay, so the same thing you can do with the uh, iPad. Same, same, same. It's a very same application. Okay, there's no difference in the usage of the interface. Okay, and that's all. So now you can use something like an application called APK Share. So they don't uh, download. Your friends won't download the app uh, from the internet. Uh, you just install APK Share from the uh, App Store uh, for Android. This is only for the Android, okay? And then you can uh, <coughs> share the app with your friends, the app and Copa, a number of times, okay? And in this way, okay, uh, all your friends can, uh, you can host them, okay, present them the app, then they can view whenever they want, okay? So, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, bye, okay? Please uh, subscribe to my channel, and also, uh, Type any comments, any questions, I'm ready for them, okay? Goodbye.